Hey guys, this is JNM with an answer to a user request on how to open a panel in Unity by clicking a button. Ok, this is Unity 2018, I created a new project and first I add a UI button, if there is no canvas it is created automatically and the text of the button is set to let's say open panel and after that I add a panel, resize it and set the color to a black tone and also add a text to this panel in a white color and the text will be hello, I'm visible. So this was the UI part very fast and now but the request was about how to open this panel dynamically. So I deactivate the panel by default in the inspector so that it is not visible and I will create a C sharp script to open it, this means to activate it. So first I create a new folder, call it scripts and inside of this folder I add a new C sharp script. I will give this script a name, for example panel opener and then I double click it and it will be opened in Visual Studio 2017 which is my programming IDE for Unity. Ok, here's the script with a class called panel opener and the first thing that I add is a public variable of type game object, to that I will assign the panel that I'm going to open. I don't need the start and update method so I will delete it but I add a new public method that is called open panel. Inside of that method I check if the panel is assigned, if it is not null and in this case I will call set active for this game object. Ok, the next step is to assign this panel opener script as a component to the button. I just drag it into the inspector with the button selected and after that I assign the panel to the public panel variable that we added to the script. Ok, now the open panel method should be called on clicking the button, so I use the on click event. You can see this here in the inspector, then I drag in the button to the slot and select panel opener open panel. And that's it, now we can go ahead and start this game, press the button and the panel will be opened. Very simple. Ok, I know this already answers the request, but let's assume that we want to toggle the visibility of this panel. So I rename the text of the button to toggle panel. Then I open the script again and first I want to know if the panel is active. I can get this information by using the active self property of the game object. Now store this in a local bool variable and to toggle the active state of the panel, I just call the setActive method with the inverted state of the isActive variable. So I use the exclamation mark, which is the not operator, to always toggle the active state of the panel when this method is called. Ok, so let's try, start the game, press the button and the panel is visible, I press it again to toggle it. So guys, I hope this answers the request and the tutorial was interesting and useful for you and if this is the case then please don't forget to subscribe to this channel to be notified when the next one is online and think about being my patron, this would really help this channel grow. So thanks for your support, thanks for watching and I'll see you on JNM.